this is going to be a tough division, guys. So when I say number four, don't think these teams are going to be trash. These teams aren't going to be – these teams aren't trash at all. At all. Don't get it twisted. It's not. This division ain't doo-doo. They, they got a lot of good talent on both sides of the ball, every team. So it was tough for me going through this. But I got Pittsburgh going number four. I'm sorry. Pittsburgh gonna start off hot, like I said, five and one possibly. They probably end up with about eight and nine wins. It's gonna be a tough division, like I said, tough division. The whole AFC is tough. Pittsburgh gonna end up in four. I got Cincinnati. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The defense is gonna take a huge step back for me. Like I said, Jesse Bates. Shout out to that guy. He's a centerpiece in that locker room, I feel like they're going to miss a lot. You know what I'm saying? From his leadership, playmaking skills, calling out the defense, all that. Jesse Bates will be missed. Cincinnati will be third. Cleveland! Cleveland! Believeland! Y'all going to be number two. My opinion, y'all going to be number two. Fighting for that uh, wild card spot. And number one, let's talk about the Baltimore Ravens, can we? Let's talk about the Baltimore Ravens. Lamar Jackson, Odell Beckham, Zay Flowers, J.K. Dobbins, the defense, the coaching, the organization, the culture. Baltimore. Number one, I ain't going to say number one seed. Nah, I ain't taking it that far. I ain't taking it that far. But number one, when it comes to the predictions at the AFC North, Baltimore number one, I'm going to say it again. If you don't like it, you get one of these. <laughs> Baltimore number one. Cleveland Browns number two. Cincinnati Bengals number three. Pittsburgh still is number four. Now I ain't gonna lie to you, the third and fourth spots I was I was flipping back and forth with. The only reason why I gave Cincinnati the edge over Pittsburgh, their quarterback play. I like Joe Mixon better than Najee Harris, and I like their receivers better than Pittsburgh receivers. However, that Pittsburgh defense is scary, always been scary. All Mike Tomlin defenses, coach teams, they play hard. They do what they got to do. You know what I'm 